I see no reason. There's lots of things, especially on, you know, souped up engines and stuff like that, where anytime they even have a custom pan built, I usually see a lot of them because they don't quite fit and we still got to go in and remodify them. So I welded on lots of pans. Don't really like to because this is cheap ass tin and it's a pain in the ass to weld, but once it's welded, it's done. Well, we trust you. If it leaks, well, we we'll... talked about it before. That's why I came back here. It won't leak. Just don't put no oil in it. It won't leak. And then we don't have any oil in it, so we're so fine. See? Can't leak. It'll be beautiful. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we will test it. We'll, we'll fill it with static. We're going to fill it with water and make sure it doesn't leak just under static. This might leak. Might have a gas. I, think, I don't know I'm if not this... worried about that. I'm going to be looking at this. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think this is leaking, actually. Well, we're going to have to do, make sure that stuff off. If you see... Uh, this is old enough. We just fill it full of sawdust just like they did in the old days, and that stops the leak. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> If you see any leaks, ruins the engine, but it looks this like this leaking is just going to be replacing the plug, and any of this leaking is just really is just the gasket. That's I don't think you'll have a problem with that. Yeah, I just want to know that the well here, and I didn't like the idea of just welding something to the side of it because your hose is pulling on it. You got it no be, surface yeah, contact. Yeah, I agree. This is an actual tank fitting designed to be welded on tanks. What was that big tank you had out here that when we were here before? Do you remember it had baffles? That was baffles. a water tank that was going to be for a, a fire truck. That's what we figured something like that. Why is all the baffles just to hold the tank? It's because that goes on a on a basically so car an all wheel drive. It goes on a skid and a logging piece of equipment. A lot of rough. So when they're crawling or they're yeah, side it, healing or something and they fall into a hole this way or that way, the weight of the water can't tip the whole thing over. Okay. The guy that's driving it, the way that the operators tell me, they don't even feel the water move at all. That's cool. That's what so I was telling you know, I didn't you know, know if it was for gallons, That weight of that water, 1,500 gallons, if it starts sloshing, it could actually that, topple things. And that stops it. That's, who thought of that? You? Well, they wanted me to baffle it, and when I seen what they were putting it on, I baffled the living daylight. <laughs> I it thought it maybe it was like for it. strength. For it doesn't do much for strength. It helps the side walls a little bit, but that's all quarter inch plate the strength is in, in the baffles. The baffles are strictly to contain the water. Yeah. The water right. movement. All right. Well, free cool. flowing water, no restriction on free flowing, pumping it out, but no movement inside when they're going across and over logs and stuff like that. So Okay, I'll get this taken care of for you. All, all right, right, buddy. Thanks. We'll get you a Thanks. call. You bet. Thank you, Mr. Sheldon. So Sheldon. Sheldon? Sheldon. Yes, now I'm Hollywood. Yeah, you are. <laughs> hey, uh, if you want to watch it, uh, we'll have it on our YouTube channel. Okay. Which is, uh, you want, Steve, you want to write that down? Yeah, you'd have to write it down because I don't know.